Hi, welcome to my channel, Make Your Life Easier. Again, this is Kim, and I'm here for a review of a fragrance called Eternity from Calvin Klein. I have so many memories about this perfume way back when I was living still in the Philippines and I was so broke and I cannot afford any fragrances so I used to borrow it from my uncle when I was about to go out with my friends and I remember that I go up to his apartment and then I ask uh, can I borrow your fragrance because I cannot afford one and because of that memory this is the reason why I came back wearing uh, perfume once again for uh, not wearing for about a decade because this perfume is really a dumb reach for me. I start wearing again this perfume last summer, last year and as you can see it's almost half empty and so now let's get on with the notes. So top notes is mandarin, lavender and green botanics. At the heart notes, it has jasmine, basil, geranium, and sage. And on the base note, base notes, it has sandalwood, vetiver, rosewood, and amber. And with the presentation, there's no cap on the perfume, just the automizer. We have the uh, name of the perfume in front and the name of the house. And there's nothing on the back and a sticker on the bottom. And the box again we have the name of the perfume and the house and the batch code at the bottom and some informations on the back this perfume is always compared to platinum egoist from Chanel but this perfume came out first and because during the 90s uh, perfumers are really fond of lavender and this is one of the greatest perfume that was invented during those times and I can describe this perfume as a barber shop smell like uh, it smells like when you just came out of the barber shop you know the tonic that the barbers the barbers are using when you are having your hair cut and using after shaves so that's the kind of perfume this is it is really mass pleasing and it's never cloying, never polarizing. You can please with everyone when they smell this perfume. It's really easy going. Okay, now let's go on with the performance of this perfume. There's a blast of alcohol and citruses once you spray this fragrance. And maybe that's why the longevity is just average on this. And when I use this, I spray it like five times all over my body and then wait five minutes and then I'll spray it once again. That way, uh, I can get almost 10 hours plus on my skin. Well, that's just a tip from me. And with the projection, the projection of this perfume is good not great but good it's not a room filler but you will get noticed it also gives an average sillage or scent trail if you like a lot of people asking me what perfume should i buy or should i wear first when i'm only only starting to wear perfume and i recommend this especially when you live here in japan because out of maybe about a hundred thousand men only a hundred men wears perfume and those hundred men wears samurai or kenso stop buying those stop wearing those perfume because you, they all smell the same you have to be different if you want to be noticed and if you want to have compliments and this is not that popular here in Japan it's popular in the Philippines but not here in Japan and those fragrances are really loud really really loud unlike this this is more acceptable and because it doesn't bother anyone 
even if you pass by them or they can smell you you just smell like very pleasing as I've said before you smell just like you just came out from the shower and with just uh, you know lavender notes it's really uplifting this is considered as a green fragrance hence the color and it is very versatile you can wear this in summer spring fall even in winter I tried wearing this in winter and it still projects and it still have a, a good longevity but it's not that great so you have to layer it once again and it's really different so I suggest you should buy this if you're just a beginner on wearing perfume instead of you know samurai and cancel <laughs> don't wear those <laughs> be easily your signature scent really smells good and this comes in a hundred ml bottle less than $30 on your favorite retail stores so I recommend this you can blind buy this even a blind person can blind buy this that's how good this is as I've said don't buy those regular cancels and those aquatic samurai fragrances it's just too bad <laughs> you want to feel a little class go with this Calvin Klein eternity uh, this is on uh, eau de toilette concentration I think all the perfume just came out recently but it's still not available here in Japan you can get it from the internet I think but I think it's just the same that I heard that all the perfume uh, lasts a little bit longer it's not that long but maybe a couple of hours longer but this is really cheap and that one is a little bit pricey I think maybe about $20 more or so anyway so if you enjoy today's video today's content please don't forget to subscribe to my channel make your life easier again this is Kim I'll see you again soon for more travel videos and perfume reviews okay thank you bye